of today's day, I find out whether I will be staying at University of Oxford and doing my undergrad degree here next year. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I just thought I would quickly make a video um, to update you and the update is that unfortunately um, I will not be continuing um, my undergraduate um, journey at the University of Oxford after completing my foundation year. That's the rundown if you don't want to keep watching this video but yeah. Hi guys, I'm Ali Abdel. I just posted my first ever YouTube video. Finally. Congratulations. Thank you. You did it. I did it. The hardest part is starting, but we're here now. It was a difficult year, and I'm not going to deny that. There were so many challenges and hurdles, but I think we got through them, and I'm so grateful to everyone who was there on my journey and supported me throughout. Thank you, it means so much. My room is so big, I live in the old hall. Okay, 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 I'm coming. Okay, gotta go guys, bye. It has been a lot to process, and I made this video possibly about a week and a half now, and I still couldn't find myself able to post it. I still kind of, maybe potentially I'm a little bit in disbelief that I'm starting over again. I'm on a new journey, comes with change and so much adventure and so much unpredictability and that's something that I'm learning to approach with more positivity than I have before. It can be difficult when you imagine a future for yourself and things don't go to plan. I'm definitely not the only person that this happens to life and life keeps going and we don't know what's, what's going to come around the corner and I guess I'm really just taking my time to process that um, things haven't went as planned um, the future now is so a lot more feels a lot more uncertain but I know I can do it and I think I can over and I don't want to admit how many times I've tried. Um, it's difficult and I feel like whilst I'm celebrating what a grand adventure this is, I think I would be lying if I didn't say a big part of me is grieving what hasn't come to fruition and that's okay. That's normal and I think the fact that those two things happening simultaneously is teaching me who I am when things don't go to plan. It's going to, I know that one day I'll look back and that perhaps I will look at things a lot more in perspective of the bigger picture of what, what I don't would have been. But for now, um, thank you for staying with me whilst I just try to mumble through what's happening right now. So without further ado, this is a new beginning.
been difficult adjusting to change this was in my first week like not even first week this is my first few days of having moved in and things can get overwhelming and they did um, and yeah I still feel a little bit weird about sharing this kind of footage um, so bear with me if you also find it weird I apologize um yeah it has been difficult unfortunately um that's just you can't shut off your emotions and that's it there was something about going to see the queen her majesty the queen her majesty queen was second lying in state um different people hundreds and thousands more different walks of life coming together that just felt really really beautiful to me and I thought I'd add this in there because it was part of my freshest week. I'm so grateful for my friends and my flatmates, thank you for your love and kindness. I still feel at times though that I am back on that train for the first time reconciling with the fact that I am moving to a whole new place but hey this is a new start. See you soon.